Our next destination is Cat Cat Village, and it's very beautiful. So, Cat Cat Village attracts a lot of people because not because of its natural beauty, but because of its people culture. Cat Cat Village is a far two kilometer far away from the center of Sapa, so it's really close. You just need to. Uh, Use your car and go for ten minutes, and you're just there. The there is three main stream in Cat Cat Village. The names of the three streams is Tien Sa, Golden, and Silver. Those three stream from the top of Hoang Lien Sen Mountain go down and merge together into a waterfall. Which name is Cat Cat? In the middle of the 19th century, the Hmong people discovered it, and uh, at the early 20th century, the French discovered it and built resort on it and named it the Cat Cat Waterfall, and then the name was changed to Cat Cat for uh, easier saying. And at the Cat Cat Village, they built a lot of studio for us to take picture. And uh, at the festival, they sing songs to so uh, we can hear it and enjoy the music. The waterfall just flow continuously, so we feel like we are closer to nature. And these Hmong people are dancing the traditional dance of Hmong people. And uh, this guy is fluting, and he is playing the love poem of mountain. And behind my back is Meat's house. These are traditional Hmong house. They are normally built against mountain walls and usually just. Far, far away from each other, about three meters, and it um, walls and roof are made out of wood. And this is the giant water wheel of Cat Cat Village. These are usually made of bamboos and are giant. They utilize water uh, power, and they are used to pound rice. And if you like, you can visit the house of Hmong people here. If you go there, you can eat traditional food and feel what it's like um, living here and being here. You can ride horse or llama, but you have to pay money to get the photo. And you can also uh, take photo on the swing, and there is also a button. And um, you. Can do handicraft. You can wear her mom traditional clothes to take photo with it. I think it's a great experience to go there, and it's really good too. So I think you should do this every time you go to Cat Cat Village. You walk around fifty thousand steps to get around Cat Cat Village, and we are very tired when we almost go home. So we order a bike to uh, get us home. It's a real great experience for me, but my family uh, they say it's terrible because it's very fast. But for me, it's fun. We get I had to ride with the wind, and it's very cool. Thank you for watching, and goodbye. See you next time.